So the session today was about the importance of uh, nutritional approach and nutritional management in uh, uh, GI and hair, throat and nose cancer patients in order to have a better outcome on medical and nutritional status point of view. So the main conclusion is that um, nutrition um, um, status just before surgery is important to check. Uh, that nutritional support is uh, quite important to, to um, implement in daily practice in order to enhance postoperative course, uh, especially for uh, GI cancer patient and especially regarding the infectious complication rate that is quite lower in patients that will benefit from pre- and post-operative nutritional uh, uh, supplements uh, when compared to a, a malnourished patient without any nutritional support. Yes, I think that we, we need to have um, uh, some degree of communication with patients since um, a nutritional is a, a translational approach uh, that will uh, implement a uh, medical approach for many days, many weeks or, or many uh, months and we, uh, I think, uh, need to have um, the patient uh, comprehension for a better approach and better results. My uh, talk was about the, the impact of uh, immunotrition in the perioperative setting. Uh, since uh, we know that nutritional support will uh, improve the, the postoperative course, but we have since um, uh, 2000 uh, now some um, uh, products that implement standard, standard nutrition with some micronutrients and this combination with um, um, vitamin, beta-carotene, uh, omega-3 fatty acids, uh, glutamine and RNA will um, give um, uh, better results than standard arterial nutrition and through uh, many randomized controlled trials and through fixed meta-analysis um, we have uh, definitely a benefit in using um, pre-operative and pre-operative uh, immunotrition uh, both in uh, malnourished and well-nourished patients uh, in order to decrease especially the postoperative infectious complication, complication rate um, in patients uh, which are malnourished but also well nourished in the perioperative setting. Oh, I think that uh, the level of our guidelines is uh, very uh, high at the moment with the grade A level of recommendation and that is enough to uh, promote such approach with immunonutrition systematically in uh, each hospital for each patient that will treat um, um, uh, upper GI and GI cancer patients.